I believe that this law is going to help because it's going to keep people from ruining their lives. David Longstreet's six-year-old daughter was killed by a drunk driver back in 2012. He has pushed for stronger DUI laws ever since, starting the Emma Longstreet Foundation after he and his family were involved in the crash. On Friday, the Longstreets and Mothers Against Drunk Driving celebrating the state's newest DUI measure, which goes into effect on Sunday. Our state's ignition interlock law will finally go to the stronger version that we've wanted for so long. Starting Sunday, it will, be, it will apply to all convicted DUI offenders instead of just some of the first-time offenders, and that difference is huge when it comes to protecting public safety and saving lives. The ignition interlock system is designed so a person would have to blow into a device in their car in order to start the ignition. To prevent someone from cheating the device, there is also a camera that shows who is blowing into the device. We are fortunate in South Carolina that we have the staff to review the logs that come in. And so when we see a violation, we have staff that are able to look at it and reconcile it to see if it's actually the restricted driver giving the sample or not. From now on, every person convicted of a DUI will have one of these devices installed in their vehicle. According to officials, each device will cost the person around $130 per month. Last year alone in South Carolina, there were more than 5,000 DUI-related crashes, killing more than 300 people. Advocates think that the new law will be a difference maker. Every one of these collisions, every one of these injuries, and every one of these deaths was preventable. The drivers just simply had to make the right choice to not drink and drive. It still hurts. I keep thinking after 12 years, I'll be okay. It's still very painful. When this new measure goes into effect on Sunday, South Carolina will become the 35th state in the country to have a law like this on the books. At the State House, I'm Joey Matei. Watch Fox News, local first. To stay up to date with this story and more, make sure you subscribe to our Watch Fox YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you never miss an update.